Narcissus was a Greek god who looked at his reflection in the pond and fell in love with himself. And he got so enamored of his own image that he fell in the pond and drowned. Well, narcissism is being so interested in yourself, your own aggrandizement, your own profit, that you don't see anyone else. In capitalism, it doesn't pay you. You are not a good businessman or woman if you give people exactly what they earn for you. You know, then you're not getting any profit. And what's the point of being in business if you don't get profit? So you are cheating people from the get-go. If you have compassion for your fellow citizens who work for you and worry about their being constrained rather than you getting more, you won't be a good business person. So built into the capitalist business plan is narcissism. That's ultimate narcissism, where you don't care about connection, you don't care about other human beings, you just care about yourself. And capitalism is the fertilizer that grows that narcissism. I, I think that capitalism both causes narcissism and then is is an effect of narcissism. This idea of not being able to see outside of yourself toward the needs of others. If you're going to have a system that requires sharing, like if you're going to transition from capitalism to even regulated capitalism or, you know, democratic socialism, if we're not going the full whole hog, some other system, you need to be able to think about the needs of others. And that is something that real narcissists cannot do. Meanwhile, it's like if you grow up in a society that 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 teaches you that not to think of others, to race to the top, undermine your neighbor, your friend, the people that you're selling product to. If you don't, you'll be undercut by Walmart or one of these other big corporations, etc. It, it makes people fearful. It makes you think only of yourself. It 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 kind of shoehorns people into narcissism. Where if you have a society that is based on a common good, it 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 mitigates against rampant narcissism. It sure does. Co-ops are the example of that, where your livelihood doesn't depend on outdoing your neighbors and your friends on at work, but cooperating. That's the opposite. 